All right, guys, welcome back. You've been practicing your double unders from the last video. Hopefully, you're having some success with it. If not, no worries. Practice, 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 and you definitely will get the technique. What we're going to do in this one is we're going to expand a little bit on the double under technique and incorporate the other two basic bounce steps, the alternating foot step and the high knee step with the double under training. So grab your jump rope, get your timer ready, and let's get to work. Okay, what we're gonna do here is we're gonna do four alternating foot steps, picking the knees up just a little bit, and then incorporate one double under. Very similar to what we did in the last video. So, this is the bounce step, this is the alternating foot step. If you're not quite familiar with those jumps yet, please go back to the first video and practice those steps before jumping into this one. All right, here we go. So we're gonna go four alternating foot steps, one double under power jump. Ready? One, two, three, four, double. 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 Perfect. Now from the side, making sure again that we're not kicking feet forward, we're not pulling the feet up behind, and we're not tucking the knees up into the chest. So nice tall jump posture. Okay? One, two, three, four, double. Two, three, four, double. Three, four, double. Four, double. Double. Oops. Double, double, and double. Okay, so the workout is gonna be for 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds break. So we're working at a two to one ratio. We're gonna do this for four total rounds, two minutes of work, 45 seconds rest, not including that last 15 seconds. So, grab your timer. Mine's already preset. Well, the alternating foot step, the bounce double under, is going to be the first step. The second one is we're going to incorporate the high knee step, where the knees are coming up nice and high. Exactly the same way as the alternating foot steps, just slightly more intense. So this one we're going to count four high knees and then one double under power jump. Ready? One, two, three, four. 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 Excellent. And then from the side, again, same thing, making sure that we're not kicking the feet forward on the double under, we're pulling the feet back, we're keeping the toes pointing straight down, but importantly, getting that knee up nice and high, and that's what makes the difference between the alternating foot step and the high knee step. So from the side, ready? One, two, four, double. One, two, three, four. 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 Break. Okay, so the workout is going to be for 30 seconds of work, 15 seconds break, four total sets for two minutes in total work, 45 seconds break. We're going to alternate between the alternating foot step and the high knee foot step. So follow along with me and I'll guide you through the entire workout. I've got my timer already set, 30 seconds work, 15 seconds rest. Guys, let's get busy here. Ready? Starting with the alternating foot step and the bounce and the double under. Let's go. and then one double bounce. Power step, double under. Ready? Three, two, high knees, let's go. footstep with the power jump. In three, two, one, here we go.
Last one coming up. Definitely gets you working. I love jumping rope. <laughs> Here we go. High knee step, last set. Two, one, let's go. two minutes. So if you didn't quite get it, not a problem. Just keep practicing over and over. And remember, count out your steps and be deliberate with the push down of the toes and the thumbs for the double under. Until next time, guys, keep practicing and I'll see you there.